Hey, what's up? In this video, I'm gonna give a demo of the Reddit app that I've been building. So we can go up here, we can go to a subreddit, we can click refresh. It will then pull the information from that particular subreddit and I'll show you that it's correct just by going to, where is that one, uh, funny, here we go. So you can see it pulls the information right from the subreddit. Um, now I've actually added functionality to leave comments also. So let's click on this dog logic post right here, this one, and we'll also click on it on Reddit itself. So when I click on it, it brings it to brings us to the comment thread for that particular post. So now I can, if I wanted to reply to the post, I could click up here and I could leave a comment, or I could click on one of the comments and I could leave a reply to a specific comment. So let's actually choose one. Let's go to um, let's go to one that doesn't have a ton of replies. So let's go here, this one right here, brave boy. So let's find that. Uh, where is it? There it is, right there, brave boy. But before we leave a comment, we actually have to log into our Reddit account. We can click log in, and we can log in with our Reddit account. My Reddit account is Mishtavian, and I'm going to skip the video ahead here so you don't see my password. And then we click log in, and it logs into your Reddit account. Now we can actually leave a comment. So I'm going to click on this brave boy comment here. I'm going to say, this is a test comment, and we'll post that. And there we go, it says comment post was successful. Now let's go over to Reddit and let's refresh the page. And where is my comment? I can't see it on the comment thread itself. Maybe let's go up to, um, let's actually log into my account. And let's go to my profile. And you can see right here, there's the comment. Um, I'm not sure why I couldn't see it in the post itself. Let's click on context. And we can see that there is my comment right there underneath Brave Boy. So it actually did post to the thread. Uh, one more feature that I added also is you can actually view this post in a web view. So like on Reddit, the posts, the uh, the subreddits are all different. So I think the best way to do it was just to open this up in a web view because some of them pull images from Imager, some host the images on the website themselves, but it uses a lot of different websites. So I think the best way to do it was to actually open it in a web view. So if we click on the image, which you just saw me do right there, it will actually open up that particular post in a web view. And there we go, there is our our post. So this, this app covers quite a few things. We're, we're gonna be going over retrofit, parsing XML, parsing JSON, posting JSON, um, and, and also integrating your Reddit account into the app itself. So we, we integrate the app into the Reddit API. They have an open source API. And I'm gonna take you through step by step so that you can do it even if you're a beginner. I would actually suggest you try doing this if you're a beginner, you're going to learn a ton. So if you want to learn how to build your very own Reddit app and integrate it with your Reddit account, check out the videos in this series. If you have any pointers or anything that you think would be cool to add, make sure you leave comments below. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you haven't already, and thanks for watching.